二零二三年第廿六條題目咧係有關於 DNA 指紋分析嘅。咁下面呢幅圖咧就顯示咗一家六口嘅 DNA 指紋分析啦。啊，點解佢哋要咁樣做啊？就因為咧佢哋就做緊一個罕見遺傳病嘅篩查啦。咁之前我哋做咗大腸癌嘅篩查啦，今次呢就做一啲罕見遺傳病嘅篩查咯。咁成條題目啦，就考返我哋呢有關於 DNA 指紋分析嘅概念啦，溶膠電泳嘅機制究竟點樣做㗎啦？同埋學識睇返呢我哋一條條基因嘅帶呢，佢哋嗰個規律啦。咁而家啦，我哋先去講返 DNA 指紋分析或者溶膠電泳，我哋要點樣做啦？首先啦，我哋呢。喺個人體嘅不同嘅細胞啦，就去抽取一啲 DNA 樣本先，然後啦，我哋就用翻個 restriction enzyme 限制酶咧，就去攞翻一啲 DNA 嘅小片段啦。咁呢款酶咧，如果大家係有讀呢個 elective four 咧，咁大家就會學噶啦 ，restriction enzyme 亦即係限制酶啦。佢就將嗰啲 DNA 咧長條嘅 DNA 就斬做細細段嘅，咁就形成一個 DNA 嘅片段啦。咁呢個 DNA 片段呢，佢係有唔同嘅長度嘅，有啲長，有啲短，有啲長，有啲短嘅。咁然後啦，我哋就將呢啲剪咗嘅 DNA 嘅片段呢，就倒落去做溶膠電泳咯。而溶膠電泳呢，其實就可以將我哋呢一啲 DNA 嘅片段呢，就跟從佢哋個大細呢而分開佢哋，從而啦，我哋就見到一條條嘅帶啦。而呢啲帶嘅規律呢。就係、是、我哋嘅 DNA 指紋分析咯喎，咁而家題目就講啦，哇！呢、這個病咧就喺成年嘅時候咧先會發病嘅，咁我哋發現啦，二號仔同阿六號仔咧，佢哋都已經係發咗病噶啦。咁而家我哋做西查啊嘛，係咪？喂，阿二阿六已經中咗招啦，咁究竟仲有冇人都係咁不幸中招呢？成條題目最關鍵嘅概念就係考緊我哋啦。既然佢哋有同樣嘅基因遺傳病，咁即係話啦，佢哋有同樣類型嘅基因突變，嚟從而啦就令到佢哋有同樣嘅疾病基因。或者多過一個基因啦，所以你見到啦 ，disease gene 或者 disease genes 啦，所以當我哋啦去剪佢哋嗰個基因嘅時候咧，我哋應該係會揾到一啲大細相若嘅 DNA 片段嘅，所以啦喺呢條題目咧，我哋就揾翻啲共同嘅 DNA 帶咯喎，做呢條題目好簡單嘅啫，你只需要一把間尺或者一個熒光筆咧就可以噶啦。首先咧，我哋就揾翻阿二同阿六嘅一啲。共同嘅 banding 咯，一嘢畫過去就係啦，係嘛？第一條咧係有粉嘅，跟住啦，第二條咧又有粉嘅，咁跟住其餘嗰啲咧就唔關事噶咯，係嘛？佢仲有呢兩條啦，佢仲有呢兩條啦，都係阿二同阿六咧，佢哋都係不共通嘅。咁而家我哋睇啦，啊，有冇邊幾條都係共通嘅咧？哇，大件事啦！呢度咧全部都共通㗎，咁即係點啊？三個都係答案啊？唔係，因為你見得到啦，真係咁共通嘅。係呢條呢條同呢條 band 啊嘛，所以答案咧只得一個，就係、是、四號仔啦。Two two three question twenty six is about the DNA fingerprinting. So for the example, so for this diagram, it shows the screening of a rare genetic disease in a family of six members. For the whole question, it shows us the concept of the DNA fingerprinting, the mechanism of the gel electrophoresis. And read the pattern of the bands on the gel. So let's go through the DNA fingerprinting first. Firstly, we need to extract the DNA from the body cells. The blood, the semen, and the hair are the common source of the DNA. And then we need to obtain the DNA fragments by using a type of enzyme. We call them restriction enzyme. So for the restriction enzyme, you will learn it in the elective four. About technology, but no matter you learn this enzyme or not, we know that the DNA will be cut into different size of the fragment. So some longer, some shorter. They are the DNA fragment containing different variable region. So after we obtain the DNA fragment, we are going to separate the DNA fragments. So we use the technology called gel electrophoresis to separate the DNA fragment according to their size. So we can see different banding of the DNA, and then the pattern of band obtained is called the DNA fingerprint. It is unique to each individual, except the identical twins. So now, 
the exam. So now let's take a look at the question. The onset of this disease occurred in Adderwood. And then members 2 and 6 are already shown the symptoms of this genetic disease. So which member is likely to have inherited this disease too? So we have the answer 1, 3, 4, 5. For doing this question, the critical concept is that the individuals who suffer from this genetic disease have the same disease gene or genes due to the mutation. Therefore, after we extract their DNA and then we use the restriction enzyme to cut it into DNA fragment, so we should obtain DNA fragments of same size. Therefore, there must be common band on the gel. So let's take a look at the DNA fingerprint. We look for the common band. So for doing this question, you need a ruler or a highlighter. So for the common band, duh, and for the common band, duh, okay? So you can see that, oh my god, for three, four, five, all of them, they have a common banding. Whoa. So do I need to choose all of the answer? No, no, no. Because for the really common because for the real common band, it should be the 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 these three, right? Two, six, and four. So the final answer should be number four.